In a significant move to modernize its military capabilities, Morocco has entered into a strategic partnership with Tata Advanced Systems Limited, TSL, a subsidiary of India's Tata Group, to locally produce the WAP 8x8 armored combat vehicle. This collaboration is a key part of Morocco's broader defense strategy, aimed at enhancing the country's strategic autonomy and establishing it as a rising player in the defense industry within the region. The initiative also strengthens the long-standing ties between Morocco and India, two emerging economies with growing cooperation in the defense sector. The Moroccan Ministry of National Defense announced that the project, which is set to be completed within 36 months, will initially feature a local integration rate of 35%, which is expected to increase to 50% as production progresses. The agreement is projected to generate around 90 direct jobs and 250 indirect jobs, providing a significant boost to Morocco's industrial ecosystem. The partnership will not only fulfill Morocco's defense needs but is also intended to increase exports to international markets, supporting the country's goal of creating a regional hub for defense production. The investment agreement benefits from financial, fiscal and customs incentives, involving various ministries including defense, interior, finance, industry and investment. The project underscores Morocco's ambition to strengthen its defense industry, attract foreign investment, and bolster its role in South-South cooperation. The WAP, Wheeled Armored Platform, is India's first amphibious infantry combat vehicle, designed in collaboration with India's Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO. It is engineered for optimized survivability, enhanced all-terrain performance and superior firepower, making it well-suited for Morocco's varied operational environments, including amphibious and off-road missions. The vehicle has been presented in several configurations, including a version with a roof-mounted remote-controlled weapon system featuring a 30 by 113 mm autocannon and a 7.62 by 51 mm coaxial machine gun. Another variant integrates the BMP-2 turret, equipped with a 30 mm cannon and similar armament. Additional configurations can be equipped with anti-tank guided missile launchers, offering versatility for combat and support roles. Its integrated power pack, automatic transmission, and flotation capabilities further enhance its utility in amphibious missions. This partnership marks a pivotal moment in Morocco's defense strategy, as it diversifies its international collaborations and reinforces its military capacities. The acquisition of WAP vehicles will not only upgrade the Moroccan Armed Forces' operational capabilities but also foster technological transfer and skill development in the local defense industry. By establishing local production with TSL, Morocco is taking a proactive step towards self-sufficiency in military equipment production. Trials for the WAP have already taken place in Morocco, and deliveries are expected to commence soon, with a delivery timeline of three years. This collaboration represents one of the largest orders of Indian-made armored vehicles, marking a significant milestone in India's defense exports as well. In addition to production, the collaboration with DRDO and TSL will ensure ongoing upgrades to the vehicles based on operational feedback maintaining their effectiveness over the long term. The partnership between Morocco and Tata Advanced Systems to produce the WAP 8x8 armored combat vehicle locally is a major step forward in Morocco's defense modernization efforts. It highlights the country's focus on strengthening its defense industry, achieving strategic autonomy, and fostering technological growth. This collaboration not only enhances Morocco's military capabilities but also positions the kingdom as a growing player in Africa's defense sector. As the project progresses, it is expected to attract further investment in both the defense and high-tech industries, contributing to Morocco's long-term economic and industrial development.